In the following examples, we're asked to find out if the function is even, odd, or neither. So let's first explain what it means to be even and odd. So we have f of negative x, so we, what we do in the function is we plug in a negative x, and if it outputs f of x, which was the original function, we say then that it's even. If we plug in negative x and we get the opposite of f of x, meaning the signs change completely, we say that it's odd. So let's take a look at this example first. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to plug in negative x and then I'm going to evaluate it. So let's see, negative x right there. So I have 4 times a negative x quantity squared plus 3. So negative x squared here is just a positive x squared by the order of operations. And I get this. So f of negative x here equals the original function when you compare. And since it equals the original function, we call this one right here even. So this is what it means for it to be even. All right, now let's take a look at the next one. We're going to plug in our negative x in here as well. And let's see what we get. Okay, so we plug in our negative x. And when you have negative x to the third power, it says negative because this is an odd exponent. And a negative times a negative then is positive, so 6x cubed. And this one becomes 5 times negative x minus 5x. So here is our f of negative x. And then when we compare it to this one right here, okay, so when we compare these two, what happened? Well, this went from negative positive to positive negative. So the signs changed completely, and that brings about this case right here. When you plug in negative x, you get the opposite of f of x, and that's exactly what this is right here. So this one right here we say to be odd, okay? And now let's look at one more example. Now let's plug in the negative x. So f of negative x equal 5 times negative x to the fourth power plus 5 times negative x and then minus 2. So negative x to the fourth power is this is an even power, so this stays positive. So this is 5x to the fourth power. This right here, positive times a negative is negative, so minus 5x, and then minus 2. So here is our f of negative x. Okay, when we compare these two, what happens? Well, when we compare these two, we notice that this went from plus plus minus to plus minus minus. The only thing that changed was the sign in the middle. So this is neither even nor odd, and so we say then this is neither, okay? So this is a little look at even and oddness of functions, all right? And it has some more applications, especially when you get to trigonometry. But uh, just for your reference, I would consider graphing these so that you understand what it means graphically for a function to be even, odd, or neither, okay? So good luck.